Well, how do you do to Danny, guys? Welcome back. Another episode of Code Games. We're coming to the end of season one almost now. Just a couple episodes left. Last episode, a bit emotional. Um, cried, I think, for the first time in Code Games. Um, just, you, f you, f you feel just being, just dying, you know? Uh, a little bit unexpected. And then, uh, Suzaku just turning now, he's gonna turn into a killer. So, Lelouch has just, you know, completely altered the fabric of what is going on there. So it's going to be interesting to see how he progresses, not know, not being able to look at people without the power taking over. Um, maybe he'll just walk around with sunglasses all the time, like um, Mao did. Uh, so yeah, it'll be interesting to see how this progresses. Um, we haven't seen any new gas users, um, so maybe... There wasn't there isn't that many and when she said there's 13 we didn't you know that was just a, an expression i don't know either way we're going to move on to episode number 24 now guys but of course before we do if you do enjoy this video if you do want to watch more of these daily reactions hit that like hit that subscribe it would be very much appreciated so um, without further ado guys let's get to the video all right then so here we go Penultimate episode of the first season. Episode 24. To recreate CC's powers? How do they know about her? What's the name valid? Hang on, hang on, is that? Is that Clover? Or Clovis, or whatever his name is. Uh, I mean, am I right there, guys? That's Clovis. It makes no sense. He was literally killed. Well, it's going to be a big battle. I thought midnight had already passed. Oh, that's why it happened. Okay. He's gonna shoot him, isn't he? Yeah. Oh dear. Bye bye. And of course, these things can't fly either, so everything that lands on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> Out thought her again. Hmm, something's going on here. Yeah, exactly, because he won't know that. Hmm. Yeah, because of it. Oh, we're on the new opening. Oh. I thought this would come at the the end of the at the start of episode twenty six. That's very provocative. But yeah, fighting off uh, the newly reincarnated Clovers is going to be an issue, definitely. Oh, I love that now. Now I understand that the, the, the conflict is going to be between them for this part, for this arc. Uh, now I fully understand that. So, episode 24. The collapsing stage. <laughs> I order you to come back alive. Maybe you should have a gas power to make sure that happens. Did she remember who she was then? Because she's obviously killed those guys pretty easily. Oh. 
Wow. You know, you would never have seen Suzaku do that two episodes ago. That's Suzaku? No. <laughs> well, uh, unlucky goes. <laughs> <laughs> just just go around in one circle just to wipe out everything in the air. <laughs> What's the point? He'd win the entire war on his own. Doesn't need anyone else. Hang on, hang on. I'm sorry, sorry. Oh, oh okay, I hate this. I just have to go back because uh, I kind of missed that. I don't know why I missed it. What collaborator? What collaborator is he talking about? Are these all princes? He must be the heir. That's a pretty useful weapon. <laughs> <laughs> the cat. <laughs> the cat. <laughs> hmm. I guess no one knows that that's his sister. Well, of course they don't, because they don't know who he is. Oh, she's revealing herself. Didn't see that coming. <laughs> so he's like saying he did that. Like, he's saying like he's celebrating it. He guy wants to kill you, and he probably do pretty nearly. You know, you lose to him every time you fight him. But how did she get her memory back? I'm confused. How did she get her memory back? Why buy arm? They both lost an arm. All right, let's call it a draw. <laughs> it, rem it reminded me of the Monty Python sketch, uh, the Black Knight. Tis but a scratch. But why, why would that matter? Lelouch literally just took out the entire air defences, just one circle of firing. Maybe we'll find out why she got her memory back. Mm, same as before, right? Mm. I fell into the trap again. Yeah, 
Yes, well, he's thinking of things logically. You're thinking of things on your emotion. Well, that's a lot of firepower. I would not want to be running into that. <laughs> I'm, I'm not going to lie. That just seems suicidal. I'm sure he's got a plan to take them out. Yep, there we go. This 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 nightmare is just ridiculously overpowered. I understand what Toto's saying there. Has she laid a trap? Has she outsmarted him for the first time? No way! She shot him. What a bitch. Don't like her at all now. What a bitch. Man, I wanted to find her and do something. She's got a little bit crazy. I mean, obviously, you know, killed her sister, but... Damn. Oh, oh dear. Has that gone through her? Oh no, he's being controlled. Well, that's a nice way to say thank you, isn't it? <laughs> thank you, Dalton. Remind me not to piss Zero off or even be do a thing for him. Uh huh. I, well, okay, I wasn't expecting that. Oh, okay. Oh, it's getting tense, it's getting interesting. So, um, a lot happened. Um, I wasn't expecting to. <laughs> well, a lot of it actually. <laughs> it's very clear that Zero is very smart. Um, trapping, you know, he knows exactly everybody's weakness and he knows what he needs to do. And um, I mean, Suzaku's going to be captured. Cornelia's in trouble. But um, I feel sorry for Ugi, you know. That's the. Uh, took care I mean obviously it's a little bit perverted in a way um, you know you can't really base a relationship on something like that you know lying and no uh, you know not telling the truth uh, but for her to shoot him that's a bit harsh you know and you know he's a nice guy uh, so I want him to find her you know and punish her because she's a bitch um and just lots and lots of battles going on I mean this this nightmare that Zero has is just ridiculously overpowered. I mean, it just blew out two entire air groups. Just, oh yes, let's just... Zzzz. <laughs> it's like, you know, no stopping it. Um, and then obviously we had a couple of glimpses there as to Clovis. His biometric form, whatever it is that they've done to him. I mean, that's obviously going to play a factor somewhere down the line. And... Um, The, the, the blue-haired girl with the glasses who was friends with Yuffie, and I can never remember her name. 
she's picked out a nightmare so she's going to do some damage that you know zero wouldn't have been able to anticipate that lelouch wouldn't have been able to anticipate that because you know, barely knows her so you know there's a lot going on and then this girl this vv just appears to to um to nonali so we i mean my, my working theory there is she's gonna tell and then Ali, who, who he is, I, I don't know how, I, I, my guess is that this is like some sort of relative to CC, and they're like, so, they're like supernatural beings, and there's like a, a whole group of them. Um, maybe that's why they can control this super powerful um, nightmare, and you know, all to do with what they found on that island, and all of those monuments they discussed all that time ago, finding all around the world. And uh, maybe she's here to like balance the scales, because it's clear to her that Zero is too powerful. I don't know, and she's uh, she knows that Nonali's probably the only person that would be able to talk Lelouch down. So maybe that's why she's there to tell him who he is. Um, and I do kind of feel that it's going to be revealed um, because it's going to be the last episode, and the generals escaped. Uh, so yeah, the, 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 I, I suspect that's what's going to happen. So you know, I can't wait to find out. I'm going to go and watch it right now. But um, thank you very much. That is the end of this episode. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed it, guys. If you have, don't forget to hit that like and that subscribe. It would be very much appreciated. But unfortunately, that's all for now, guys. So we'll see you again next time. Bye-bye. Uh,